We're saying some of these rocks look like they've fallen and just wedged Those themselves. Those rocks there, came down 40,000 years ago, brought down by an underground earthquake. Wow. The next one's due in about 10 minutes. Right, so we're out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Off we go. <laughs> Thank you. That's all right. That came down on head though, I don't think we'd worry about it too much. <laughs> we're just saying that round there. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow. We can miss out. Wookie Hole guys, the village of Wookie Hole. Now we gotta find Wookie Hole. Well, guys, we're in Wacky Hole. Wacky Hole? Wacky Hole? Wacky Hole. Wookie. Wookie Hole. <laughs> and it's wacky. <laughs> so here we go. Very wet at the side, isn't it? See all the water coming down. Damp, yeah, so you watch slippy. You alright? Something just dripped on my head. <laughs> Something's cooking. something's cooking and brewing, which is pot. Oh dear! We're getting deep into the cave now. A lot of people think these caves will be mined out, and that all this has been formed by water erosion. Two ways really, water comes into the bar and the river acts undercutting the rock from the line. That's what's forming these caverns. Still a river down there, is it? That's the river axe going from left to right as we look at it. Wow. That's formed in a corn pub. Where you came into the cave earlier on up there on the right. That's yeah. where the Riverbed of the river after the beam about a million years ago. It's actually trapping its way down, so it's still doing it day by day. When does it start? It actually starts a little bit further up, near Swaldens Hole and Privy. Sort of very fragmented, gathers together here underground. When you come out of the cave exit, you look across the valley, you'll see it come above ground for the first time, stays above ground then, all the way across Somerset, it just saves the rest of the two from Pleasure. Surprising what water will do, won't it? Given enough time. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> That's the river running down there, look. It's amazing, isn't it? Fancy boat trip. <laughs> Amazing. 
see me what water will do all the time. Yes, yeah, sort of line that water will come down. Mm -hmm. Amazing, eh? look at that. So there we go, guys, that's the cave where the water's still running through. I'm watching my head. Gotta duck a bit here. Well, I'm nearly on my hands and knees. <laughs> oh, that's the trouble being 12 foot tall. Do you oh, there's me joking, you do. You're right. Good job, you got air. <laughs> I'm standing right till they drop down, I. So you can see there guys, water still dripping down there. So this is all through water erosion coming through. Wookie hole. Wookie hole, I keep saying that, huh? See the water running still. Good job you haven't got your slippers on. That's high. See the water running down the steps. This is where I could bang my head now, guys. Don't want it. So, no roof, no shit. See where it's running under where them lights are still coming running around. Can you? See where the lights are it's running under there. Still running around. The site of this first was ever cave dive on the 14th of July 1935. Graham Balcom and Pamela Powell. So, what he said. To get firmer, they had to wait for the invention of Stephen Allen in the uh, 1960s. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Everybody ever died doing that? Yes, this is true. Unfortunately, so. Right. Some kind of feature. Okay. Right. Right. That's quite a nice story. Should we go back up here?
low again. So we're coming back up out of that cave there, guys. Back into another one. Look at that. See that thing up there? It's amazing, isn't it, guys? Look at that. That's a river running down there. This is the cave. The... Look at that rock there. Oh, that don't drop. See that one? <laughs> yeah. Watch this low here. <laughs> Jess, Soph, I think you'd have loved this. Seeing this, definitely you would, Soph. And Jess. Look how the falacos up there. Bit wet here again. Yup. Hey. Oh. She's down here. Very narrow. I like the fairy lights. <laughs> it's not Christmas. I was saying the girls would love this, wouldn't they? Have to bring you here. See, Jess, see what you're missing? <laughs> wow. <laughs> you having to really duck down here to get round there, that bit, guys. Wow. Amazing. Look how deep and clear that is. Some of these rocks are just jammed down. It looks like they fell down and just jammed between. See that one there? Some steps up again. Hello there, you're right. Alright. That's a bigger height, isn't it? 120 foot off the top of there. When you put all the ants up on the 20 foot by the top of the cave. Wow. That even a trampoline, that's a safety net. I was gonna say to stop stuff coming right down. There when we blasted that tunnel five years ago. Oh right, yeah, yeah. And then 60 foot down there people do cave diving from. They still do that now? Cave diving, yes. yeah. Oh yeah, now it's a bad frog. <laughs> Yeah, We're saying some of these rocks look like they've fallen and just wedged Those themselves. Those rocks there came down 40,000 years ago, brought down by an underground earthquake. Wow. The next one's due in about 10 minutes. Right, so we're out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Off we go. <laughs> Thank you. If that came down our head though, I don't think we'd worry about it too much. We <laughs> were too bloody, it'd be a bit of a headache, wouldn't it? <laughs> we're just saying that round there. Yeah, I mean, when we opened that tunnel, for the first two years, we had to wear our hats. Yeah, yeah. What could a bloody plastic car that? <laughs> <laughs> I do if it comes on your head. <laughs> yeah, we're up and tumbling down. But hey, uh, it's clear, isn't it? Wow. Brilliant, thank you. Thank you very much. Sorry? I said thank you very much. That's all right. I've got to ask a lady a question before you move on. You've seen the cheese? What goes well with cheese? Crackers. Boring. 
<laughs> wine. There you go. Got to be wine. There's the wine in the cider. Oh, what wine? Have a look. Wine is cider for you. Cider, it's more cider, baby. Yeah, we've got it in the shop. <laughs> Cheers, thank you. All the best. Crackers. Yeah. So keep it under here. For, like they were saying with that cheese back there. Um, because it's like a fridge in here constantly, isn't it? It's echoey in here. It's set up, it's, it keeps it uh, 11 de degrees all year. In here, whatever well, the weather. It's well. 11 degrees all year. That's what they keep it at. Whoa. I read that, I know my stuff. <laughs> Outside, like, outside, outside. Oh, we're gonna go down again. Not outside. And it's raining. Oh, it's raining. Oh, it's just slippy. Yeah, you got a coat. <laughs> Hello. Must be the end coming up, by the looks of it, guys. Wookie ho! Oh. Wookie ho! Wookie cave ho! Oh. Back into the rain. It wasn't raining when we come in. So, that's that river, isn't it? It's going through it. They're on about. Can't go up there at the moment. There it is coming out the cave. Even the little axe. Okay. So, yeah guys, there, there you go, there you have it, Yuki Hole, that was interesting wasn't it? So we're going to try and get out this rain back to the van and we'll probably catch you a bit later on tonight. Bye for now. Well that was interesting guys, that was good wasn't it? It was really good. That was well worth the money, um, going looking around there, how much was it for the just the two of us? It was 35 it was 35 pounds. Pound. But it was worth it just to see obviously what the history of this sort of area and they've also got this hotel, the Wookie Hole Hotel. Which is hat on the uh, <laughs> So yeah, interesting. Wookie Hole. So we're going to uh, head back to the van now. And around the coast. Next destination. Next destination of the night, another park for night um, at the book. A pub, what was the pub again? It's the Smugglers, Smugglers Inn. Inn, which is just on the coast, going round from Western Supermare and up around. It's up around there. So we're, we're just in the car park here. There's Ivy. So yeah, for today, I think that's it for now. And we'll catch you tomorrow. Bye for now.